Hello, welcome to Richard Banker Web Design Tutorials. Today we're looking at how to add a featured image to your article. Uh, there's some advantages to features images, featured images. One is that you can, uh, it's very easy for non-techie users to be able to add images to your content and get it to show up the same every single time. So right here you can see in this article we have this picture of this rooster and we're just going to refresh. We've got a blank slate and we're going to dive right in. So, differences between featured images and just a regular image that you add to your content. If I'm adding an image to my content, I have to go to where I want. I have to either use the image button down here. I'm just going to use the same one just so it makes sense. Insert, and then I have to play with how this looks back and forth. and. Sometimes, you know, the text is running into it and all these different things. Let's just have a look, see how this looks. Now that one in particular looks fine. Let's say that we took and went like this. And say you would put a float on it. And you know, your image just doesn't look the same every single time. So what can we do to make things easier? Especially if you have staff or other people who are working on the site who don't want to play with images, they just want to put one in. Well, that's where you use the featured image. Real quick here. First, get rid of that. We don't want that anymore. So in Joomla 2, it's on this side. Joomla 3, it's up here. Images and links. Now first, your intro image. This is what shows up in blogs. So if you have a blog format where you're adding news and things like that, this is the image that will appear there. Your full article image, when you click on the, on the article in your blog, this image will appear. So if you want the same image, yes, you have to add it twice. However, if you do want a separate image, one for the blog, one for the blog area and one for when they actually click on the article, then you're able to do that as well. So plus and minus both things. So these can be set up in global as far as your image float, but the, the super benefit of all of this is that you could set this up globally that you want your featured image to be this size, you want it to be to behave this way, you want it to uh, uh, fill a space, you want it to float to the left, you want it to have these margins, this padding, all of that stuff, you can have it set up and all your staff or users have to do is go in here and select their images. Grab the same one again. And the image float, they can just leave it to your global settings, add in their alt text. Add in a caption if they want and hit save. And it's all done for you. There's no fooling around with padding or anything else like that. That is quick and simple how featured images work, and they, they appear at the top of every single Joomla article. So that way, you could play with the content and not have to worry about it uh, displaying weird within your text. It's just always the same on top. And this works really well, especially when you have banners and things like that that go across the top of the page. That's quick and easy how to add a featured image to your Joomla article. Any questions, leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, hit like, subscribe to the channel. Thanks so much for watching.